for example, that you think one of the things that really needs to happen is redistricting reform. Uh, that uh, the Republicans are disproportionately reflected in the House of Representatives and have a majority locked in because of gerrymandering. Uh, and there are a lot of organizations, including one I think the President and the former Attorney General are going to be heavily involved in, uh, that are going to seek to do what we did in California, which is have a commission that does an un-gerrymander. Uh, and if that's where your passion is, then I would get involved in that issue with the organizations working on that. And if it's healthcare, there are a lot of great organizations, some of them represented here tonight, uh, that could really use your help in a, in a national effort. Uh, but these are ways not only to help push back, fight back, but also uh, overcome, uh, frankly, the despair that has uh, crept in uh, to a lot of our lives uh, since we had this, this election. Uh, you know, I, I take solace in the fact that, uh, as the President has pointed out, um, the same country that elected Donald Trump elected Barack Obama twice. Uh, it's not as if those people all left the country and strangers moved in. Uh, we are in the same country. Uh, and, uh, uh, and so, you know, we need to reach out to people and we need to make the case uh, we need to do a better job of it, and we need to be better organized, and we need to be more tenacious. Um, I was very involved, and, and am, by virtue of being the ranking member on the Intelligence Committee, on the Russian involvement in our election, and I'm going to continue to do that and investigate it. <laughs> I do think that uh, as nefarious as what the Russians did is, and was, uh, we have to take responsibility for the fact that this was known before the election. This was known. It was known the Russians were hacking. It was known the Russians were dumping. It was known that they were dumping in a way that you, it was unilaterally helpful to Donald Trump and hurtful to Secretary Clinton. And we were not successful in persuading the country why they should care uh, or care enough. Uh, and so that's on us. Uh, we, we are going to have to do a much better job of persuasion in a lot of different parts of the country, um, not just here in, in blue California or blue Los Angeles. And so your, your question is a very important one. Uh, there are things that you can do uh, here in Los Angeles, and, and there's some great people working on it, and they're very organized, and I would look for a way to plug in on the issues you care most about uh, to the organizations with a national reach 